So the next question is example 22 of chapter 11. Two crossroads each of width 5 meter run at right angles through the center of a rectangular park of length 7 meter, sorry 70 meter and breadth 45 meter and parallel to its sides. Find the area of the roads. Also find the cost of constructing the roads at a rate of 105 meter square. So what is given in your problem? Okay. So given two crossroads each of width 5 meter is run at right angles. Run at right angles means perpendicular to each other through the center of a rectangular park. So let me take this as this rectangular park. Okay. So this will be a rectangular park. So what is running in the middle of the rectangular park? Two crossroads. Okay. Which is perpendicular to each other. Okay. So let me take the shaded portion as the crossroads. Okay. Now, what you have to find? Find the area of the roads. So, you have to find the area of the crossroad. So, what is the width of the crossroad? It is 5 meter. Here also it is 5 meter. Okay. The width is 5 meter. Okay. Now, what is the area or sorry, length of the rectangular part? Length is equal to 70 meter and breadth is equal to 45 meter. So, the diagram, I hope the diagram is clear for you. If I take the larger rectangle as rectangular park as A, B, C, D and I can take the uh, crossroads as E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L. Okay. Now there is a small square in between, right? So let me take that square as P, Q, R, S because when I take the when I take the area of the uh, path, I I will be calculating PQRS twice, right? So I have to um, uh, subtract the area once from the uh, area of the shaded portion. Only then we will be getting the correct answer. Okay. So let's uh, start solving our problem. So what we have to find out, we have to first is first we have to find the area of the roads. So if I find the area of E, F, G, H and I, J, K, L minus 1 a square then I can get the area of the road, right? So first step is to find the area of the rectangle, rectangle E, F, G, H, E, F, G, H. So if I draw the rectangle here separately, so this is going to be your E, F, G, H, right? Now, what will be your E, F, G, H? What will be your length? So, here the rectangle is taken in a vertical manner, right? So, no matter which you select, length and breadth, whichever you select, you are going to get the area uh, as the same answer. So, let me take length as uh, your height, okay? Length is equal to 45 meter. So, 45 meter and breadth will be equal to 5 meter, right? So, if I take in this case, is equal to 5 meter. So, area is equal to, EFGH is equal to area of uh, EFGH is equal to length into breadth, which is equal to 45 into 5, so 45 meter into 5 meter. So, what is the value? 45 into 5, 5, 5s are 25, 5, 5 are 20, 21, 22 which is equal to 225 meter square. Meter into meter, you will be getting meter square. So, this is over. Now, what you have to find out? Area of the rectangle IJKL. IJKL, right? So, this is how your IJKL looks like. IJKL. So, what is your length here? Length is equal to 70 meter and breadth is equal to, the width is equal to 5 meter, right? L is equal to 70 meter, breadth is equal to 5 meter. So, area is equal to, area of I, J, K, L is equal to 70 into 5. So, this you can solve it, 7, 5 are 35, you have to add 1, 0. So, 350 meter into meter, you will be getting meter square, okay. So, second area is also done. Now, since I have told uh, you are going to for both the cases the area in between of the square you have calculated twice. So you have to subtract one, uh, one time right the area. So we should find out the area of the square. What is your square PQRS? So 
what is the area of the square side into side so what is your side here it is 5 meter and 5 meter so 5 meter into 5 meter 5 5 are 25 meter square so the area you have to subtract it therefore the area of okay the uh, cross road or the shaded portion okay is equal to area of EFGH plus the area of IJKL minus the area of the square. What is your square? PQRS. Okay. So, area of the uh, uh, rectangle EFGH is equal to 225 meter square plus 350 meter square minus 25 meter square. So, if I do it here, 350, 5, 6, 7, 3, 4, 5. Okay. So, 575 minus 25. What will be your answer? 550. Okay. So, value is equal to 550 meter square. Okay. Now, area of the cross road you have found out. Area of cross road you have found out. Now, the answer is not at over. What you have to find out again? Find the cost of constructing the roads at a rate of rupees 105 per meter square. So you, ha you have to find out for 1 meter square if the value is equal to rupees is 105. What is the cost for um, constructing 550 meter square? So I am taking the next paper. So I can write that the cost of constructing constructing per meter square so 1 meter square of road is equal to what is the cost 105 rupees therefore what is the cost of what is the area total area you have got this 550 therefore the cost of constructing 550 meter square of road is equal to 1 to many so 105 into 550 okay meter square. So what will be your answer? 550 into 105. It is enough to calculate 55 right? 5 fives are 25 2 1 five is 5 again 5 2 5 ok? 5 7 7 5. You have to add on 0 because it is 550. So the cost is equal to 57,750 rupees.